Hello everyone, how are you all? I am Mo and you are welcome or welcome back to my channel where I talk about mostly Korean and Japanese skincare, sometimes Indian skincare and fragrances. So if you find it helpful and interesting, then don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the notification bell. For short contents and fragrance related posts, also follow me on my Instagram. Now let's get into the video because I'm back with one of my favorite topic, actually my most favorite topic and that's toner. And today I will share toners for winter season. Winter is the best time to incorporate moisturizing, milky, nourishing, creamy toners. Toners that will not only hydrate but moisturize, nourishes your skin. They will take your moisturizing game to the next level. But today I will not talk about them because I have already made this video where I shared my most favorite creamy toners. Not only that, I shared everything like how to incorporate, how to use, how to layer them where you can pick your creamy toners according to your skin type. So don't forget to check that. Today I will talk about heavy hitters hydrating toners that will hydrate and sometimes moisturize. So let's start. When I first thought of doing this video, first toner that came in my mind is this hydrating lotion from Hada Labo. It's a multi-molecular hyaluronic acid based toner that includes six different hyaluronic acid of different molecular weight. So it hits different level of your skin to give your skin the ultimate plump. I have the Gokujin one which is the premium one that is the thickest one but they also have many different versions and also sub versions regarding your preferable consistency or thickness and number of hyaluronic acid you prefer to have in your hyaluronic acid based serum. I use it as a toner during winter time as a serum during summer time. I also use it as a body serum during winter time. I mix two three drops into my hand cream and use it as a nighttime treatment because winter time my hand condition becomes horrible. If you're not allergic to hyaluronic acid give it a try and you will not be disappointed. Now we have world's the most famous product, if not the most, and I'm talking about Cosrx Nail Mucin. Now, if you are a Snail Mucin fan, sorry, if you are a Cosrx Nail Mucin fan, you can use it throughout the year, but I cannot use it during summer because it feels quite suffocating. It sometimes gives me pimples, but winter time it behaves like a good boy. You know, to me, it's one of those jacket or quilt that I love to hug it during winter time, but summertime it's like. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. It's a heavy duty, thick, hydrating essence that feels certain moisturizing at the same time. I mean, it leaves a little bit of its body after absorption. And it's a very good pairing option with any exfoliators, any leave on exfoliators if you have sensitive and compromised skin barrier because it acts as a protective shelter, protective layer on your skin that doesn't let that exfoliator to rupture your skin barrier. Now I have another very famous product and I'm talking about Numbers in Number 3 toner. Their whole Number 3 line is very famous. I have tried only their essence and I have to say that it's less toner and more of an essence. Not only from the texture wise but also from ingredient wise. Stay away if you have any fungal related issue like fungal acne, dandruff or any fungal infection related issue because it contains not 2, 3, 4, 5, more than 20 fermented ingredients which on the other hand is a very I would say an amazing anti-aging treatment. Their serum is also famous but trust me to me this essence is enough to be called as a treatment product in your anti-aging routine because it's quite potent within 3-4 uses you can see a visible result it amps up the glow of your skin it feels very uh, hydrating quite moisturizing it's a beautiful product it's hyped but it is hyped for a very good reason now if you have fungal related issues but you want to enjoy experience something like this don't feel sad because I have a product that feels very similar that is very similar to this numbers in number three toner and talking about this essence from ginger sex I rarely see people talking about this but it smells very similar the effect is very similar the difference is only in the texture I would say this ginger six uh, is lighter in texture it's still viscous but not as viscous as the numbers in one I would say it's quite fresher at the same time but once it is absorbed it feels exactly like the numbers in one that is anhydrous potent little moisturizing at the same time and cherry on the top it's a peptide based toner yes an anti-aging peptide based essence or toner without any fermented ingredients 
try this one but remember both of this toner have very strong rose smell almost like dabar gulabari okay so if you are not comfortable with them then stay away and lastly i have an interesting toner toner with an interesting texture because it's a rice toner but it's not milky it's a transparent yet moisturizing little nourishing toner and i'm talking about this goodal rice toner look at the texture look at the consistency this is what i call the heavy duty toner it will take your hydration to the next level one bottle and your winter is sorted if you are scared of trying milky moisturizing toner but you still want to experience the goodness of of rice then give it a try you will not be disappointed before i finish i want to show you something this is the condition of my underarm okay i saw this comment in my underarms video today morning i epilate my underarms and this is the condition i will show the another one i got this uh, pimple over here not pimple it, it was a boil okay so this is the condition of my underarm happy with the result and that's all what other winter care video you want me to film drop me in the comment section and don't forget to give this video a like and share it with your friends till then bye